welcome back to everyday grind happy friday how are you guys it's the weekend time and you know that means we got three days to hit our goals it's gonna be a busy weekend so let's get ready for it so where am i at for the week while well, on instacart i'm sitting at 315 dollars 81 cents walmart sparks for 93 dollars 70 cents for a grand total of 409.51 i got three days to hit 500 dollars, which should not be a problem all right what is our goal for today our goal for today is going to be 200 dollars. all right so let's get the grind started all right guys until our first pickup all right just got my first order of the day it's a 20 dollar uber eats pickup from bonds going, left to stay on i8 west going 8.9 miles but five miles of it is me driving to the bonds to pick it up so we're headed there right now to pick that up I just picked up that order. Uh, delivery is only 2.8 miles away, so which is really cool. So that's gonna be nice and quick. We're heading there right now. And I'll see you guys at the drop off. and picked up my next batch it's a costco batch for uh 60 dollars two customers i think it was a total of 23 items yeah 23 items so we're gonna go shop that right now guys just finished up in that order 25 minutes wow what a crazy order eight cases of water three case of pacifico making my way to my first drop off which is 2.7 miles away we'll see you guys over there all right no drop off action on that one um the guys came out and actually took it out of the the trunk which was awesome saved me from carrying all those stuff up there Turn so left onto park boulevard make my way to my second one which is only one mile away four minute drive so we'll see you guys there Got my workout done today, guys. That was crazy. Two sets of stairs. 10 cases of water later, we are all done. All right, just picked up my next order. It's from Panda Express from Uber Eats going uh, 4.1 miles for $10. So we're gonna go pick that up right now. All right, just picked up that order from Panda Express. Gonna make my way to my drop off, which is only 2.5 miles away. Seven, seven minutes away. All right, guys, we are currently sitting at 1,200 subscribers. So thank you all who subscribed to the channel. Really means a lot to me. If you haven't subscribed yet, just click on that subscribe button right below. And also don't forget to hit that notification bell when I drop my next video. All right, let's get this order dropped off and I'll see you guys there. All 
I just dropped off that Uber Eats order. But most of my app's been very quiet so far today. Um, DoorDash, there's only two areas in San Diego that is actually uh, red and says busy. But everywhere else is pretty much uh, a ghost town. Um, while my spark was going off for a little bit earlier this morning, there was anything, nothing really good. There was one shop one, it was like $36, but it was the same time I was doing that uh, Instacart order for Costco. So I wasn't able to take it. Uh, here comes the DoorDash. Let's see, or right, Uber Eats. Look at this, $2.81 going 1.7 miles. Definitely not taking that. So, anyways, we're heading towards uh, Point Loma area. Uh, my son is done in front of the gym in a half an hour, so maybe we could just pick up like one more before I have to get him. All right, I just picked up my next order. It's uh, Uber Eats for wing stops uh, for $9 going 2.7 miles. So we're gonna go get that right now. All right, just made it here to wing stops. Let's grab this order. Forced? Forced? Yeah. No drinks? Oh. All right, just picked up that order from Wing Stops. No issues. Order was ready as I got there. Making my way to my drop off, which is 2.7 miles away. I just dropped off that Uber Eats order. The time is now one o'clock, so I'm gonna do, probably take a half an hour off. I gotta pick up my son from the gym, drop him home, grab something to eat, and then we'll be back around 1.30. I'm sitting at, I think right around $100 right now. Uh, so I'm about roughly $100 away from my goal. So should be able to hit it. All right, guys, until our next pickup. All right, we're back and look at these three batches on my screen. $18.86, two items, seven units, 19.5 miles. I don't think so. All right, next one, $33.89, going 13.8 miles, five cases of uh, sparkling or water. One, two, three, four, five, six other cases, 13 things of bananas, eight things of strawberries. I don't think so. And then the last one, look at this one. Triple shop, $38, 36 miles, are they crazy? 20 items, 34 units. The first item is six one gallon jugs of water. And then, no, I don't think so. All right guys, until our next pickup. All right, guys, we just picked up another batch. $31, only going six miles, a total of uh, nine items. We're going to go shop that right now. guys I just shopped that order in uh, 10 minutes no replacements no refunds I'm gonna make my way to my drop-off it is a little crazy with traffic up here so drop-off is gonna take a little longer than normal this one's only going 4.1 miles but it's gonna take me around 14 minutes so we'll see you guys there at the drop-off
right guys let's drop that order off no issues batch price came out to be 3103 uh, it took me a total of 45 minutes which is pretty cool heading back to costco again see if we can pick up another one all right just picked up the next one it's a costco batch for 19 dollars seven items i'm not going to get an add-on so i stacked it with the walmart spark that's like literally around the corner for 21 dollars going five miles so we're going to go shop the costco one first and then go over to walmart and pick up that one All right, just shopped that order in like seven minutes. I'm not too sure. I was just rushing through getting it so I can go pick up this Walmart Sparks. Cool thing is literally it was like just like a block away. So we're here right now. I'm gonna go check in and hopefully they have this order out in time. <laughs> I just picked up that Walmart Sparks. Like I said, I make my way to my Costco drop-off, then we'll do the Walmart Sparks, and then come back and try to do one more to get to the, my $200 mark. Just dropped off that Walmart, not a Walmart, sorry, Costco order. And then uh, the Walmart Sparks, guess what, guys? In the same direction. So it's only like 1.5 miles away. So we're going to head there right now. just dropped off that Walmart Sparks no issue gonna make my way to Costco I need $29 to hit my $200 goal that's the goal let's get it all right just dropped off that Walmart Sparks heading back to Costco I'm very close to my goal I think I need like $29 all right guys until our next pickup all right guys just picked up my next order it's uh from DoorDash for 1425 3.4 miles from Ellen Hello Wine Barbecue so we're gonna go pick that up right now All right, so I just picked up that order and I was able to stack it with that door. Uber Eats for $23.45 going five miles in the same direction from Felix Barbecue. So we're gonna go over there and grab that right now. All right, so I had to cancel that Uber Eats. I'm so pissed because man, they have my order right there. Nobody's begging it. They're just taking their time. They have one item that they need for the order and nobody's making it, nobody's even paying any attention to it. So I just canceled it. All right, we're making our way to drop off our uh, DoorDash order. And then we're probably just gonna head into back into San Diego and uh, hopefully I can pick up one more to hit my goal. If not, just gotta add it for my goal for tomorrow. The only good thing about that is the uh, DoorDash order went up to $16. So we're gonna head back into San Diego, run through the numbers, see how I did today. Even though I know I already missed my goals, I'm a little annoyed because of that uh, Uber Eats order. That $23 would have well put me over my goal for today, but it is what it is. All right, guys, I'll be right back with the numbers. All right, guys, let's run through the numbers and how I did today. But first of all, a little rant about that Uber Eats order. I'm telling you, I understand the restaurant was busy. Don't get me wrong. I've been in the restaurant industry. I know what a Friday and Saturday night looks like. But the one key thing that I always take away from there, when you're busy, don't skip orders. That's the worst thing you can do as a restaurant is a skip an order, whether it be takeout, 
dine-in, curbside pickup, whatever it is. As they come in, just do them as they come in because the minute you skip an order, you're gonna throw off the kitchen, you're gonna throw off your servers, and it just becomes a cluster of, can't say the word, and nobody knows what's going on, and sure enough, that's what happened with my orders. You know, they told me it was gonna be uh, 10 minutes, 10 minutes turned into 20 minutes, 20 minutes turned into 30 minutes, so, you know, it was just so frustrating. Anyways, with that said and done, let's run through the numbers. All right, on Instacart, I ended up doing a total of $113. Walmart Sparks, $21.94. Uber Eats, $39.15. DoorDash for $16 for a grand total of $190.09. Missing my goal by $10. All right, guys, if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more videos like this, if you haven't subscribed, don't know what you're waiting on, click on that subscribe button. Also, don't forget to hit that notification bell to get notified when the next video comes out. And don't forget, keep on grinding. Hey, I'm hustling, hustling, hustling.